Hi guys, in today's tutorial I'd like to show you how you can create time lapses with a moving camera without any mods. So this is done with command blocks and the good thing about that is that it also works in snapshots. So uh, you can just put in a second Minecraft account to your world, set up three command blocks and a scoreboard and let the camera fly and today I want to show you how you can make that happen. So in order to make such a time lapse, you need of course the coordinates where you want to fly from and where you want to fly to. And for my example, I choose this village here and I guess that I want to fly from somewhere around here to somewhere around here and also this direction. So what I need to do is uh, get the coordinates of these spots and I will put them in Excel in just a second. So what you need is the X, Y and Z and also the angle, so you can use these x, y and that and then the angle is uh, these here. These two are important too because we want to fade them too. And then you need to know in what time you want to fly and for me that will be 30 seconds. So I will get those coordinates now into Excel and meet you then over there. So over here I've got the coordinates now, the coordinates where I want to start with the angles and the coordinates where I want to stop with the angles. And then I already said that I want to have it in 30 seconds, so a 30 second time lapse, and I want to speed it up. So if you want to speed it up, then you just uh, put in the speed that you want to speed up, so four times the speed I want to have it. Uh, so um, then you can calculate the steps by just doing 20, because that's the tick amount, times the time and times your speed, and that will give you the steps that you need to do for your teleportation. Then it's actually quite simple because you can just do the coordinates uh, where you want to stop minus the coordinates where you want to start. You can of course do that all without Excel and do it in a calculator. So uh, here I can see now that I need to go uh, 57 blocks in X direction, 22 in Y direction, 48 in uh, Z direction, 81 degree in one rotation and 15 degree in the other one. And so now we need to figure out how many teleports or how much teleportation per step that is. And therefore you just uh, divide those numbers here um, by uh, the steps. So for me 2400 and also drag it down. And these are now the numbers that we will need in just a second when I go over to the game again. So now we are getting to the command block action and therefore if you're in snapshots you can already use the new command blocks because we need command blocks that are getting triggered 20 times a second and in uh, yeah normal command blocks or with normal command blocks you can achieve that by a redstone block clock but if you've got these new ones you can already use the repeat ones that will already trigger 20 times a second. But before we fill anything into that we need to add a scoreboard and um, therefore I would just call it step and it's type dummy. This will tell us at which step of our trajectory we are and then for each player that is currently flying on the trajectory we need to detect if the score is in between 0 and uh, the number of steps that we have. So for me that's 2400 uh, step equals 2400. Uh, we just Add, I uh, got forgot the add, scored players, add at all in this range, step one. So um, I can just take this command block now because the next uh, we need the same thing here in the center. So what we need is uh, teleport the player to his starting coordinates, and therefore we just put in once here because just for the first step we want to teleport. Uh, the player to the starting coordinates, which is uh, minus 496.0 for me, uh, 68.0, 10 uh, 0, 37 and 30. This is my starting coordinates and uh, then we want to teleport the player each step. So from 1 to 2400 we want to teleport them relative. So what I will do now is put in the relative coordinates that you can see there and this will take a moment so I will speed it up. And there we have it. And all I need to do now is power these is if it is normal command blocks with a clock, if it's repeat command blocks just with uh, redstone power. And then I can start it by typing in scoreboard player set as the petty step to zero 
and this will teleport me over and now I'm starting to fly, you can already see it. And uh, this is quite slow because, whoops, I wanted to uh, speed it up to four times the speed and that's what you saw in the beginning. But uh, this is how it is working and you can see that this is already quite smooth. If you speed it up, you get way more frames per second. I mean, this is now 20 teleports per second, so technically 20 frames per second. And uh, if you speed it up, you will get way higher frames. But uh, that is it for this tutorial. I hope that you enjoyed it.